Ten centuries shall the fortress stand, walls of spirit wrapped in walls of fire. And horned lords shall bow their heads to one not yet born of the darkest sire. One century of blood and strife, the moon shall darken and none know why. The resting place at last is found of the seventh who soared so high. daughter of a forlorn line shall guide him into history. Beneath the crypts prophecies clash, the war of ancient enemies. Welcome to a new Let's Play. This is Dark Messiah of Might and Magic and it is a game by Arcane Studios and Ubisoft from I don't know what year, probably 2007, something around there anyway. And uh, it's like a, it's an RPG but not in the same way that Lands of Law or Bloodlines is an RPG. It's a lot more action orientated, it's very gory, it's quite sexualized, it's quite an adult game. And uh, what we're going to be doing is playing through this. I've already played the first half an hour just to test it out, see what it was like. Just to make sure the settings are how I want them to be. That should be about right, I think. I might... Uh, subtitles are on. Awesome. So let's jump into a new game, shall we? We play uh, this dude who's working for a dude. Or something along those lines. I'm playing on normal. Because this game can get quite challenging. It's... Uh, a reasonably long game, not too long, but yeah, there's lots of varied environments and leveling up and fighting and epic set pieces and all that kind of stuff. And I, the Master the, Fenrig. Fuck's sake! Stop interrupting me. Where are you? I'm here, Sarah. Now listen. In the room ahead, there's an altar with a spider artifact. Take it. We'll need it to get to the Shantiri Crystal. As you can see there, your master is played My by voice will guide George Takei. And have no fear, I'll be watching over you. I think that actually might be George Takei, I'm not 100% sure, but it sounds like him. As you can see, you actually see your body in this game as well, which is a bit weird, but still. Uh, you can press O, you can see our quest, find the Shotry Crystal, attain the Spider Key. Lovely. I play Sarith, his apprentice, who is possibly the most stupid person in the entire world, but we'll touch on that a bit later on as you see the story unfold. Um, our female leader will be joining us after the tutorial level, so uh, let's uh, dive straight in. We're here to find a, an artifact for our master. He sent us into this place to prove ourselves, so let's go and find it. So far, so good. Is that the spider goddess? Use the spider key we found, Sarah. Yeah, I know. Fucking hell. Chill out, dude. I'm fucking take my time. I'm having a look around. Fairly ominous door if I ever saw an ominous Pull the door. Lever, Sarah. Then hurry through the far gate. See the sprint in this is actually quite good. It's not that bad compared to considering how bad sprint often is in other games, that wasn't bad, was it? See the planks around that pillar. They look weak. See if you can break them. It looks like you'll have to go up here. 
Jump on that chain and climb. As you may be able to tell, it's a source engine game, which means lots of physics and physics type puzzles. It also means it looks fairly dated, but with everything on high, it's not too bad, I guess. So yeah, uh, you can mantle up on ledges as well, pull yourself up. So there are like platforming elements to it, I guess. I don't like the fact there's loads of spider things everywhere. Presumably it means there's going to be some spiders in here, perhaps? I don't know. Physical obstacles will be the easiest you face in this life, Sarath. Now is your chance to conquer them. Conquer those great Sarath. Kick their asses. Go on. Chuck them away. Well done. Oh yeah. I was on fire. That's awesome. I'll control this crouch. This dance gonna fucking confuse me, isn't it? Use the spell I taught you, sir. And the dark will hold no secrets for you. Whoa. Okay, that's like an infrasion spout that you see in the dark if you need to. Don't know how it affects you guys, but it, it's a bit ugly to be honest with you, but still, I'm sure we can cope. Statue of some dude there, lovely. I guess we need to continue <clears throat> through these passageways. I don't know how long this lasts, sorry. See if you can open the chest. You never know what you might find. If you see a weapon, go ahead and pick it up. There will be fighting ahead. The rope, Sabbath. Cut the rope. Okay, I have a sword and we have to cut the rope. And that will cause a physics puzzle that opens the door. Huzzah. Oh, there's a dude. Think. Adapt. Kick that creature back and watch it fall. Careful. There we go. The undead are tenacious. Impel them to make sure they don't rise again. There's an I'll do my best to heal you, Sarah. Well, that's very nice of you, uh. Now is the time to use your combat techniques as I taught you. Thank you very much, George. <laughs> Die! Oh, I don't like it. You can see he's great, but. You're gonna die or not? Oh, hang on, I know he's doing something. I wasn't paying attention. Better impale it as well. I think you've got to do target it to impale it. Yeah. There we go. Give me a moment to open this door. What door? There isn't appear to be a door here. Black guards. Here. Hired swords they are. But I can feel the scheming hand of the necromancers behind them. So they too are after the Shantiri crystal. Hmm. Okay, George, I'm gonna fight these guys for you. So uh beam me up and all that. Kick him over the air. Be efficient, Sarah. But you won't make it. Oh, that was fucking amazing. That was wonderful. Here you are. Fight to your advantage. Kick him. Whoops. Too late for that. Don't try to run. Kick him against the spike. That should take care of him. Oh, 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 oh yes. strikes. It's better to block than to bleed. Yes. Did I hear something? Hey, pal. Can you shoot me if I parry? <clears throat> yes, is the answer. Break through his parry. Oh, that is <gasps> fucking awesome. You don't move, buddy. Oh, you're right, dude. Find me over here, please. Break the planks. Use the environment to your advantage. If he's still moving, <laughs> drive yourself through him. Brilliant. This Use is like the more best time to hone your skills if you wish. I'll keep the portcullis open. Come on, then, dude. Come on, I'm all day. Oh, I can just go through here instead. I have my first scout point. But let me kill this dude first. Die! <laughs> <laughs> Dish. Oh, oh, oh. God, this guy's like a pro dodger. Uh. I might die here, guys. Fuck. Die. Come 
Mark. I'm gonna focus up here. Oof. Right, so let's upgrade our scales. Um, what should I upgrade is the question. I can upgrade my max health. I can give myself sort like scales for swords and shields, scales for bows, stamina, alertness, magic. Should I be a spellcaster or should I be a fighter or... I don't really know. Cast a magic fire projectile. I think just for now. I'll go with upgrading my health. Or can I? I can't do that, no. Huh? Oh yeah, upgrade your health there after choosing this. So I guess we should just pick this once. That I can go for health next time, perhaps. Okay. Cool. Because I don't really think needing more health will be a, be a plus. Oh. And I can take these with three. Lovely. Lovely. Health is restored. Let's climb up here and see what's going down. What now, Master Fenric? We're done for now. Let us hope that you will be as efficient in future tasks. This is only the first step on a long road. Wonderful. Now, take that crystal. You'll have a use for it a half a world away. For today was just the beginning, my boy. Let us return home, and I'll show you the next step in your education. Wonderful. Let's get going. Huzzah. We're back home. This guy didn't seem that nice, our master. He seems a bit, a bit off. All those years working aboard the Enterprise, it's got to him. We have brought you the Crystal Master. Hazar. Sarith, my faithful disciple. Your father would be proud to see you this day. Initiated into the arts of magic, a fierce and noble warrior. You have all that you need to achieve your destiny. But you won't achieve it here. Your future is out there, in a distant land. I'm sending you to the free city of Stonehelm to meet a wizard named Menelag. He and I have certain mutual interests. Hardcore point. Right now, he's looking for an artifact called the Skull of Shadows. Unfortunately, he's unable to progress any further in his search. At least not without this. The Shantary Crystal that we retrieved. It was worth our pain to retrieve it, don't you think? Yeah. Take, Take it to Menelag and help him get the skull. Once you do, I think you'll know what's expected of you next. I have no idea what you're talking about. However, my dear boy, I am not sending you alone. You'll need a guide, a companion. Perhaps even a guardian. She may even teach you a few other things. What is your bidding, my master? One can travel lighter than two, Sarah. Am I to protect this boy? Hello. Sarah, go back off. Like Fear right. not. This won't hurt a bit. I'm sure it won't. By the way, my name is... Zana. What the hell just happened? I'm not going to read these title screens because they usually load too fast for me to get through it all. So, you read them yourselves and everything will be great. Sareth and Zana have now arrived at Stonehall. Zara lives inside Sarath, and he doesn't seem to think that's a bit strange or anything like that. Although she is quite hot, so I suppose it's okay. There, there it is, Sarath. The free city of Stonehelm. Crossroads of money and magic. Deliver the crystal to Manalag, and we can be on our way. I hope so. It's been pretty dull. We should go back to the city, where it's safe. The farther we get, the better! Everyone's oh. running away. The VR too, if you don't drive faster. There's an army of necromancers coming! Necromancers. Pretty answers. Fenric didn't say anything about them. Master Fenric rarely tells everything he knows. 
Harry will be safe inside. Yeah. I like the way it's like a living, breathing city. This is quite cool. I'm the envoy from Master Fenrir, with a message for the wizard Menelag. That Lord Menelag. Got any proof? That's We're a little wary of strangers these days. I have a letter of introduction. Let me see it then. Hmm. By special request of Lord Menelag. And there's a seal. Let me welcome you to Stonehelm. We'll stable your horse for you if it pleases you. I've changed it to you now, haven't you? Of course. Ha! Yeah. Can you tell me where to find Menelag? Suck it out to me Certainly, now. Sir. You go uphill past the Golden Ribbon and Sweet Dragon's Blood. What's that? Uh, what is that? Oh, Bullet. Get inside, quickly! They're here. They're really here. What are you going to do now? Run, run. What the hell's going on? Oh, God, look. What the fuck? I better get out of there. Escape from the doors. <laughs> 